Hi, you guys. It's Jen. Um, I'm going to do a little declutter again, another declutter of some kind, but it's not just like my, um, so I'm going to adjust myself here. Uh, it's not my makeup. It's actually my nail polish, as you can tell by the title. I don't have a lot of nail polish, but what I do have, I don't use. I don't wear nail polish. Um, I rarely wear nail polish, if at all, ever, and I haven't worn it in the last like four years. And I think obviously that is way too long to have any of this stuff. Um, I might keep, um, you know what, I don't need to keep any different top coats or anything. I was going to keep that just so I know for reference for next time, but I honestly don't need to do that because I can just figure it out. Um, I'll look on uh, YouTube or something what people are using and I'll buy it at Sally's, right? Like I don't really need to keep this. What I have. I love, I really love these, but I never ever wear nail polish. My nails are short, I have a little kid, um, sometimes I help him with the bathroom or like bathing him or picking him up, and even when my my thumbnails are like a little bit longer, if I pick him up under his armpit, sometimes my thumbs are up and they hit him in the chin, and I don't want to have long nails, like it just, I don't want to like, you know, I'm just... I'm just not doing my my nails it's not a necessity for me right now I'm definitely not gonna go out and get my nails done at a salon when there's COVID right now and I just don't really do that often anyways it's just not something I do and plus I would rather lift barbells and do that kind of stuff than get my nails done it's just a personal preference so nails are not like my thing so I'm gonna get rid of this stuff and if I do in the future have to go to a wedding or or some kind of gala or something I will go buy a nail polish or I'll get my nails done for that thing but I do not need to keep this stuff so I want to get rid of it so I want to talk to you guys about what I have in here um, this is so hard for me to get rid of I'm gonna do this one first because it's very very hard for me to get rid of this is my Sally Hansen chrome nail polish this is so old it is so ridiculously old it has got to be bad inside like it's just so old um i've had this for guaranteed guaranteed more than 10 to 15 years that's right that is bad <laughs> it's so bad it's so bad i might have even got this before i met my husband so and we've been together for a long time <laughs> So I think like it's definitely I need to get rid of this. I don't want to. This is probably one of the very sentimental items just because it's not that I'm I'm sentimental about the fact that I've had this for a long time. I'm sentimental about it. Maybe not sentimental is not the right word. I freaking love it. I freaking love it. It's one of the best nail polishes I've ever had in my life and I've never seen this again I've never seen this come out again and so I hate getting rid of this but I'm gonna get rid of it the next thing ugh, see look at this the separation so gross anyways um it doesn't even look good on top it looks like it's gross on top anyway uh this is the uh, OPI nail lacquer in peace and love peace and love and OPI so gross it's so like I would not put that on my my nails at all it's a beautiful color but no it's too old then I got this absolutely cute little mini again it's like they're all separating like that because they just settle and they're sitting there this one is in does it have a shade I don't think it has a shade it was just one of those little ones that you see at the counter when you uh, go to the salons and they have like these little itty bitty um nail polishes at the front like an impulse buy thing and they are probably way more expensive than they need to be but um it's so pretty it's got like little glitters and stuff in there i have to get rid of all these every single one oh <sighs> again everything is just going to be super separated this is by um c n d vinylux um i've never used this maybe i used it once this isn't as old it's probably more like five or six years old the other ones are like way older um, this one's in tundra and it's just a really cute like pinky shade pinky pearl it's just really pretty don't need it 
Um, I'm going to do all these ones at the same time because they are my absolute favorites and I just don't want to get rid of them, but I have to. Um, so these two I will, I'll talk about next. I have two black nail polishes. I don't need two black nail polishes. I don't even need one black nail polish. One is OPI and one is by Nina. Those are going. Then I have a, a brand spanking new top coat, like very brand new top coat. I have, and this is the American Classics Jealous. That's cute. And then I have the Sish Clear, getting rid of that. And the American Classics In a Hurry. This is again a top coat that dries really, really fast. Those are all going. Um, and then I have a couple that my mother-in-law got me from her, um, the, her, the girl that she goes to, she works out of her home and she does hair and nails, like pedicures, manicures, that kind of stuff. And so she has some stuff on hand and sold to my mother-in-law for me and picked up some stuff for me. Um, so she picked up this nail lacquer from OPI. Well, actually, you know what? No, this was just in here. This is not, I bought this one actually. This is so stinking pretty. This is, I would, I would definitely wear this for sure, but I don't need to. I don't, I don't wear nail polish. I don't. Okay. These are the ones she picked me up. So this is super badass. I love this. This is called Rose Among Thorns and it's a neon from China Glaze. And it is so damn beautiful. I love that so much. I would totally wear that if I wore nail polish. Same thing with this one. I love red. This one's called Thunderbird and it's two China Lily. It's so gorgeous. The next one is another neon. This is in the shade Japanese Koi. So pretty. I love these bright colors. Also, this one is called Under the Boardwalk really pretty and this last one is like the one that I really don't want to get rid of but this is called flip-flop fantasy it's my favorite pink I love it so much but they're all going in the garbage um, the last three I have are these and these are the ones I'm really having a hard time getting rid of and the flip-flop fantasy one um, these have they're called sand like what are they called liquid sand silver rose gold and like a goldy whatever <laughs> a goldy sand color um these are so beautiful and they they feel like like literal sand on your fingernails they're just amazing i love these so much but unfortunately i don't wear any of these and they all have to go in the garbage um this is all i'm left with is just my tools so yeah i'll oh i have some gems i'll use these for makeup the rest will just sit here until I compile more nail polishes down the road and decide to wear them again but the rest are going in the garbage it pains me to say this but if you know of a color that you think I would love if you know if they still make flip-flop fantasy let me know because I'm really having a hard time getting rid of this one I'm really having a hard time getting rid of it um, but let me know and yeah thank you for watching and I will see you guys again soon bye